Back live at Fifth Third Arena, UC 2-0 and to start the year. I'm Chris Labar with Coach Elliott. What a great start to the season. Did you think about a timeout in that last sequence there? What went through your mind? Well, I don't know what sequence you're talking about, but our game plan was to play solid half-court defense. Um, we was Our game plan was to give up to two. You know, if it was a drive, show the ref our hands, give them a two-point play. Credit to Northern Kentucky. They drew up a hell of a play. We went for the lob instead of staying solid on the three-point line. Uh, to God be the glory. You know, it was in and out. And um, we got the rebound when we needed to because they had been getting second shots all game. And uh, Brandy came up with two huge rebounds down the stretch. She went to the free throw line, made one of two on each possession, uh, each time at the strike. But at the end of the day, it was a group team effort. Um, we found a way to get stops when we needed to, make free throws when we needed to. And I'm just proud of our guys for pulling out this win against a really good note, the Kentucky team. There's really not a player that didn't contribute. Is there one, this may be the best team win you've had here? You know, we're hoping that every team is a team win. You know, we're only as good as the 12 guys that suit up and play every day. Um, we out, we play our best basketball when we play together on both ends of the floor. You know, Northern Kentucky did a good job of taking our transition offense away. We found a way to really execute in the half court by getting good ball movement down the stretch. And, um, you know, I can't say enough about our guards. We played with five guards down the stretch. Jasmine, for the first time being out there as a center in her career, and uh, she didn't miss a beat. Your defense at times really bothered them, especially with the pressure. What particularly did you guys do? Well, you know, we just wanted to try to make them feel uncomfortable. Um, we hadn't showed our press all year. Um, we showed it tonight against them. I think we started the game really surprising them with our press. We was able to get some quick points in transition on the offensive end. Um, we continued to sprinkle it out throughout the game, especially down the stretch. And uh, we just had guys making plays, rotating well, getting deflections, getting some steals, especially when we got in foul trouble um, in both halves. Big one on Saturday, I understand that. But how important is 2-0? And, you know, 2 and 0 is as important as every game we play. You know, every game we play, we expect to win. We go out and play to win. And we got guys on our team, 12 of them, that believe in each other, believe in this team. And I'm fun. I'm having a great time coaching them. You seem like yours. Thanks for the Thank time. You. Congrats. Thank you very much, Chris. Comments from Jamel Elliott. You see two for two to start the year. We're back live here on Saturday. The Bowling Green Falcons, they're also 2 and 0. They'll be here Saturday at 2. Our thanks to Coach Elliott. Thanks to all the folks here at Bearcats TV. We'll see you Saturday. And I'm Chris Labar. Good night from Cincinnati.